Yakuza 3, Coin Locker Guide, Sub People's Rebel Link for NationalWarnTruths.com. And uh, this is number 11 through 20. We're in Kamarucho still, aka Tokyo. Yada, yada, yada. Alright, so number 11 is located in the Bikini uh, Club. I think that's what they call it. Basically, it's a strip club, but they call them bikini clubs. So, whatever. Before you go inside, it's here to the right in front of this red um, vend vending machine. Number 11. Number 12 can be a little tricky to find. It's in the Champion District, uh, southwest corner. And it's right there next to the boxes. Exciting stuff. Number 13 is in the Mini Mart. I believe it's the only one in this town. No. No, there's a couple more. I'm at my bad. But uh, it's in this specific one. Well, I mean, there's Mini Marts. I call them Mini Marts. It's called the M Store, actually. But there's uh, Popos. There's three other ones called uh, Popos. And I guess it's a chain or a brand. Because one thing I found about this game is uh, that practically every in this, everything in this game is a, a real life company. Like from the food you eat to the things you drink. Um, so that's pretty interesting, you know. In fact, uh, well, the next one's here in the south uh, east part of the map right here um pretty it's uh the game does very very well in japan for obvious reasons and it um has a pretty big following in so much that there's girls that kazuma dates and i'll be doing guide they'll be part of the sub stories but those girls they have like a an audition that they go through um, in Japan, and apparently it's a pretty big deal, where they have like a TV series about it, and they pick these finalists, and it's the girls who will date Kazuma in the game. He's also called something different in the Japanese version. It's like Ru, Ryu de Gatoka, or something like that. But obviously, the Americanized version, they just. Uh, Want to keep everything simple, I imagine. So, um, there's a few things going on in this corner. Besides the locker key, there's like three or four submissions all around this area. Submissions, sub stories. So we're gonna be here a lot. <coughs> Number 17. Number 18 is in the middle of the street behind Kazuma to the right a little bit. It's on Supon Street on the west side of town. Right in front of this restaurant. Or I think it's a restaurant. For all I know, it's like a spaghetti western DVD place. Why it would be that? I don't know. Alright. Number 19 is um, under this, vol this this big building that says uh, Volcano. Volcano? Is that what it says? Volcano. volcano. Um, it doesn't appear on your map as a store or a place you can go into, but uh, it is in the theater district. Yeah, just follow the map and you'll, you don't have any trouble finding it. That's number 19. And number 20 is... This one's... um. It's in the Raigyo, I think that's how you pronounce it. But it's like kind of like a, um, like a palace, a gaming palace or whatever. But anyways, the mission starts way over here at the end of that street. You're gonna see these these kids messing with this bum, and you gotta beat up these kids, you know, save the bum, whatever. And then it kind of starts this whole uh, other mission when you gotta beat up some more kids, and eventually get to take over this building back. Um, and then, once you do all that, you won't have access to the building just yet. 
you kind of have to go run around do some things and somebody will eventually call you and say hey we got the whole place uh, set up again so you can come back and once it's opened up you can come in go to the gambling area and you'll find key number 20